Hi everyone, my name is Qi Yue Cai. She her hers, I go back to you. Currently, I'm a third year PhD student in clinical psychology at Arizona State University. This paper, entitled Parental Efficacy After Military Parenting Program, a Dynamic Latent Growth Modeling, um, try to answer the question about how parental efficacy between couples change together after a parenting program and what can impact the trajectory. Parental efficacy is an important aspect of parenting and it's an important outcome in man many parenting programs. However, most studies focus on mothers and less is known about the relationship between co-parents, parental efficacy over time, and how parental distress can impact parental efficacy trajectories over time. The current study includes 271 heterosexual couples randomly assigned into intervention and control group. Um, we use a dyadic latent growth model to answer the question, just like as shown in that figure. We have four time points and we include both linear and quadratic change over time. We include emotion distress as main predictors. We also controlling for child age, gender, parent of color, deployment length, and household income. The results showed a significant intervention effect. With both mothers and fathers, the upper two lines showed a linear growth over time. And um, both mothers and fathers in the country group, there is no significant change over time. Notably, um, as you can see here, mother's emotion distress, baseline emotion distress can impact um, both can impact their fathers based on parental efficacy and their own efficacy, while fathers' emotion distress can only impact their own baseline um, parental efficacy. Interestingly, what we found is mothers' baseline emotion distress can impact their trajectory over time, that for mothers with high lower distress, as in the blue line here, mother's parental efficacy has more rapid growth over time, but for those with mean level or higher level distress, the trajectory change over time is not uh, significant. The results are similar. There is not parental distress, um, primarily depression and anxiety. They are more like deployment length as a predictor of PTSD. So as you can see, fathers with shorter um, deployment length has a more rapid growth of parental efficacy over time. To our knowledge, this study is the first to test dyadic longitudinal change in parental efficacy uh, among military couples after participating in a parenting program. The findings underscore the importance of using a family system perspective um, and including both parents to understand the change over time. In both research and clinical work, the study highlights the, imp the importance of considering baseline emotion distress and other environmental stressors to maximum intervention benefit. It provides us important insights for developing targeted intervention to support both uh, military families and improve their well-being. That is our study. Thank you. If you have any questions, please contact us. Uh, we are happy to connect. Bye. Mm -hmm.